this is a kalpana here so in this video we are going to see a problem on heights and distance a vertical tree is broken by the wind the top of the tree touches the ground and makes an angle 30 degrees with it if the top of the tree touches the ground 30 meter away from its foot then find the actual height of the tree actual height of the tree okay so a vertical tree is broken by the wind a vertical tree consider a vertical tree a vertical tree is broken by the wind the top of the tree touches the ground and makes an angle 30 degrees with it Okay, so this is the tree. The top of the tree touches the ground, touches the ground and makes an angle 30 degrees and makes an angle. Thirty degrees. Okay, so this is the top of the tree. If the top of the tree touches the ground 30 meter away from away from its foot. 30 meter away from this foot. This is the foot. Thirty meter away from its foot. Then find the actual height of the tree. Okay, so if you are having a vertical tree and it's, it broke down by the wind and makes an angle 30 degrees and it falls exactly at 30 meter away from the foot. So we have to find the actual height of the tree. So this is the actual height. Let us name it as A, B, C. A right angle triangle A, B, C. So, so this is the top of the tree which is touching the ground and this is the foot of the tree. So, we have to find the actual height of the tree that is A, B plus A, C. Okay. Solution. That means this is your B. This is your A, C. So this is foot and this is top of the tree. So you have to find the actual height of the tree. Solution. Let B, C be a tree. Okay. And B be the top of the tree and C be the foot of the tree. Okay. So the top of the tree touches the ground and makes an angle 30 degrees with it. So we have angle A, B, C equals to 30 degrees. Okay, since the top of the tree Touches the ground and makes an angle thirty degrees with it. Okay. A 
if the top of the tree touches the ground 30 meter away from its foot. So from this we can say that BC equals to we have BC equals to 30 meter. BC equals to 30 meter. Okay. Now we have to find we have to find the actual height of the tree. So, actual height that is, we have to find BA plus AC. So, this is the actual height. Okay. So coming to the problem. Since... In triangle, right angle triangle, triangle A, B, C, right angle at, right angle at C. So, since we are having angle AB is equals to 30 degrees and BC equals to 30 meter. So, here we can find the value of tan 30 degrees. So, tan theta is equals to opposite by adjacent side or you can say perpendicular by base which is equals to perpendicular AC divided by base is 30 meter. So this is your base or adjacent side and this is your perpendicular or opposite side. Okay. So, this implies tan 30 degrees. And 30 degrees is equals to AC by 30 meter. Since tan 30 degrees equals to 1 by root 3. So you will get 1 by root 3 is equals to AC by 30 meter. So this implies AC is equals to 30 meter by root 3. 30 meter can be written as 3 times 10 meter divided by root 3 since t 3 into 10 is 30. So this 3 can be written as root 3 into root 3 into you having 10 meter right as it is divided by root 3. So 1 root 3 from the numerator and root 3 from the denominator gets cancelled. So finally you will get AC equals to 10 root 3 meter. Okay. Since root 3 into root 3 is equals to 3. Okay. 
So we have AC equals to 10 root 3 meter. Okay. Now we have to find the value of AB. Now find the value of cos 30 degrees. Not the value of cos 30 degrees. To find the value of AB, we use cos 30 degrees. Cos 30 degrees is equal to adjacent by hypotenuse or base by hypotenuse. So this is equal to, you are having base BC divided by hypotenuse AB. So this is equal to 30 meter by AB. Since you are having BC equals to 30 meter. So replace BC by 30 meter. So this implies cos 30 degrees is equals to 30 meter by AB. Since you know the value of cos 30 degrees, since cos 30 degrees is equals to root 3 by 2, so now replace cos 30 with root 3 by 2 equals to 30 meter by AB. This implies AB equals to 30 into 2 meter divided by root 3. Okay. Again, 30 can be written as 3 times 10 into 2 by root 3. This implies AB equals to 3 can be written as root 3 into root 3 into 10 into 2 divided by root 3. So root 3 gets cancelled. 1 root 3 from numerator and the root 3 from denominator gets cancelled. So this is equals to 10 to 20 into root 3 meter. So you got AB equals to 20 root 3 meter. AB equals to 20 root 3 meter. Okay. Now we are going to find the actual height of the tree. So, the actual height of the tree is AB plus say H, okay, is equals to AB plus AC or BA plus AC, which is equals to, you are having AB, AB equals to 20 root 3 meter plus AC, AC equals to 10 root 3 meter, okay. 20 root 3, 10 root. So finally you will have 30 root 3. So this is equals to 20 plus 10 into root 3 meter. 20 plus 10 is 30 root 3 meter. Okay. So, therefore, the actual height of the tree is H is equals to 30 root 3 meter. Therefore, the actual height of the tree is 
is 30 root 3 meter. Okay, this completes the problem. So, in this video, we have seen a problem on heights and distance. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.